Hello, welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be talking about journaling. I have a handful of journals that I use. I've always been into stationery since I was a little girl. I am that girl who has a stack of journals that are unused because you just buy journals. You just buy more than you could ever imagine to do anything with. So it started last year and I'm being more intentional about it this year where I actually use these journals. Especially now that I'm pregnant, I have my five-year-old son, I have my little girl coming soon. I want to document things. I want to be intentional. I want something for either myself or for my kids to look back at later and, and see memories and all this kind of stuff. So I'm going to take you through all the different journals that I have, how I use them and little flip throughs of them. So let's just get into it. Before we do that, don't forget to subscribe down below, turn on post notifications, give this video a big thumbs up. You can go follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you have it, um, but let's just jump right into it. So I use this cute tote bag um, by my friends at The Gay Agenda. So first, just like a quick showing of the different... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have five journals that I use not necessarily on a daily basis but pretty much on a weekly basis so let's just go through each of them um I'm gonna go in order of like what I use the most so we are gonna start with I guess these three so the first one is gonna be what I call my dupe for the Hobonichi weeks um planner because I couldn't get my hands on it and then I didn't really want to spend $30 on shipping from Japan and also it had like the year had already started so I was like by the time it gets here I don't know maybe I might try again next year or I might just use this situation so this is just a traveler's notebook in like a weekly format I got it on Amazon and it came in a three pack for like 12 bucks so I would say it's a pretty good deal and I just use this like metal clip to keep track of where I am in the planner. So this is what I use for pretty much everyday life, like planning. I do use my Google Calendar in my phone just to keep track of like everything. And then I also share that planner, that calendar with my husband. So all of our like family stuff is in there. But this one allows me to be a little bit more creative. So I might put like pictures in here, do a little um, one or two sentences about the day or if I wanna like know anything, obviously I'll put like what is happening in each day. And then in this, like right side column on the left page i keep track of how much i'm spending um just to kind of see it you know be more responsible with my money and stuff like that so that is what i use this um traveler's notebook refill the weekly setup i guess so that's what i use that for and then this is my i guess you would call it like a junk journal and I don't, you know what, I actually hate that name because it sounds like the journal itself is junk. <laughs> but it's just like a journal that I do anything and everything in. So I might do like a longer to-do list. So in this one, I don't necessarily put like everything that I have to do in a day because sometimes that's just too much for that little weekly planner i feel like that one's more of like an overview so in this one i might do like a more intricate like to-do list of the day i might make random lists like i i have all my like baby names listed in here when we were trying to figure out delilah's name and then i just journal as well so i have some like pre-made um layouts where i might just like write if i want to write more about my day or if i want to vent or anything like that and then sometimes i'll put like this one is just all the new stickers that i got from you know an online order so that kind of thing so this is kind of like anything and everything if that makes sense and then this one is going to be my pregnancy journal so this one is for my daughter to 
I mean, I guess it's for me, but then, you know, I might give it to my daughter in the future. The only junk thing is I didn't do anything like this for Noah, which I feel kind of sad about, but wanted to do this and I knew this was gonna be um, our last pregnancy. So I wanted to just document everything. So that's what this little one is for. This one, um, one of my girlfriends, Sarah, bought this for me for Christmas last year. And I was in a reading slump because the first like half of my pregnancy was, how do I say this? Miserable. I was sick 24 seven. I just did not feel good. I was exhausted. So I lost all my passion for reading, but luckily I'm starting to get that back. I keep one of the, bookmarks for on the books that I finished and then I keep the other bookmark in the section of like where you can do the whole book review and then I use my Canon Ivy mini printer to print the cover of the book just so I can have it like you know visually right there and lastly <laughs> this one I do not reach for as often but I do, you know, still have it and like all, it's more of like the big things that's why so it's like It's not necessarily like everyday stuff that I'm documenting in here I want to document more of like the big occasions like Christmas, Halloween, New Year's, Valentine's Day, baby shower, Noah's birthday That kind of thing. I bought this when I was in Canada. I saw it and I just was like Yeah, I need that So I purchased it while I was in Canada and I did not know what to do with it because like I said at the beginning I'm a girly who buys cute notebooks and just does not know what to do with them because they're so cute. I'm not trying to like waste them. <laughs> so what I ended up doing was starting out, I just like stabbed myself. What I ended up doing was just starting it off with Vancouver on film. So yeah, I just document any, let me see, all these that have Noah in it. So let me just try to get one that doesn't have this cute little boy in it okay cool they all have Noah in it I don't know how I'm gonna show you guys this so like this was my birthday and I had so many Polaroids from my birthday that I just like stuck them and I try to like write a little note about them but there was way too many photos from my birthday so I just I just taped them all in here so anyways these are all my journals all my five journals that i use kind of like on a weekly ish basis and then just real quick i won't go into all of my stationery maybe one day i need to make a video on like all the stationery that i have i feel like that would be a really long video but let's just get into it first so at first i just carried this one with all of my journals because it kept everything that i needed it to carry but now i just have like so many things that i want to include in here you will see that it is a hot ass mess but it's fine so i have all of the different pens that i like to use to either write or to decorate with these change sometimes but for the most part they stay the same i have a little scissors for cutting like any washi tapes or anything i have these tweezers for small stickers and placing them in my planners a ruler that expands to like a longer like this okay drawing straight lines obviously i have this um knife thingy to also cut washi tape like if i have to cut it on the paper versus like before placing it this little washi heart situation i just put that in there because it was valentine's day and then yeah i just have like a bunch of different stickers and different things like that in here in here this little pencil case it's just more it's like the other pens and other like mild liners that i don't necessarily use these colors super often but they're cute and i would use them if they fit the like theme of the spread so i just keep all of that in there and then lastly you would have seen this if you follow me i believe on tiktok but i just made this literally like last week so here are some like daisy stickers i actually have to, since these are like just loose sheets i have to put these in my other sticker folder that i have that i don't carry with me in this but these are just like 
I use this for my daughter's baby shower invites, or I guess my baby shower invites, because I thought they were so cute. Um, and then I just have these like little pouches with different like loose die cut um, stickers. I'm happy with the current journals that I have. I do not plan on adding more anytime soon because five is a lot to keep up with even though they all have their own purposes. But yeah, I would love to know if you are a journal girly, how many journals you have. I love these types of videos. I watch them on like YouTube and TikTok all the time. <laughs> so I would love to hear how your journal situation is going but that's gonna be it for today's video thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe down below turn on post notifications give this video a big thumbs up go ahead and follow me on tiktok and instagram and i will see you in the next video love you bye